Hello and welcome to Bonex Investment Group. Today we are going to talk about a simple concept yet very important. This will be about candlestick patterns. Candlestick patterns are technical trading tools that have been used for centuries to predict price direction. They were actually invented in Japan. But before we jump into the war video, be sure to check out our free signals telegram channel. The link is right in the description below. If you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button and smash the notification bell icon. So, basically what is a candlestick? A, cond a candlestick is a type of price chart used in technical analysis that displays the high, low, open and closing prices of a security for a specific period. This can be a 1 minute, 2 minutes, 5 minutes depending on whatever choice of period you choose. It is very important to understand them the institutional way because they reflect the impact of market makers sentiment on asset prices and we can use them to determine when to enter and exit trades. Candlesticks are a suitable technique for trading any liquid financial asset such as stocks, forex and futures. So basically, we are not confined only to forex when we are talking about candlesticks. So what are the market maker candlesticks? Although the candlestick subject has a ton of varieties, there are only a few of them that are of importance to us. Market makers leave traces on the charts that are identifiable to the trained eye and candlestick patterns are one of them. Being able to identify these properly and at the best market context will give any trader an edge to profit with a higher statistical probability. So we are now going to, to, to be talking about uh, the candlesticks that market makers use. For instance, maybe you are probably wondering what market makers are. If you have not been on this channel, uh, market makers are those big guys within the trading um, industry. These include uh, big financial institutions like hedge funds, banks and um, other individuals who have a large amount of capital or who have access to, to, to large volumes of contracts. So let's have a rundown of all the candlestick patterns you have to know. First on our list is the hammer. As I said earlier on that, you have to understand that for these candlesticks to work, they have to be in the rightful market context. In market maker, our rightful market context is either the second leg of M or the second leg of W or a position at the 50 EMA depending on the time frame. If you do not understand these concepts, please watch other videos on this channel or you can actually decide to take on the market maker course that is also on this channel. So the hammer is a candlestick that has a large, a large body at the extreme end which signifies buying power or buying pressure. It is actually a candlestick, a candlestick that forms after a series of red candles, then it forms, then followed out um, after its formation, there will be a series of green candles. This candlestick pattern is actually very useful when it occurs at the second leg of an M, of a W, I mean. We have a bullish engulfing pattern. This is actually one of my most favorite candlestick patterns as it works most of the time after its presentation. It also comes after a series of red candlesticks followed by a red candlestick with a green candlestick overlapping its close price or its highest price. As you can see, the red candlestick actually made its high at this point and closed at this point and closed at this point. This opened at this point but closed higher than the close of the previous candle. This also signifies a potential 
bi-direction. We also have another candlestick uh, called the morning star. A morning star can also um, occur after three swipes from the Asian box or the Asian range. If you see a morning star after the three swipes of, from the Asian box or the Asian range, it actually signifies a very huge buying pressure within the market. It also signifies injection of funds by market makers into the market. Then this is uh, an evening star. It also looks like uh, the previous candlestick pattern. This one, uh, in this scenario, this only signifies selling pressure or injection of funds by market makers in the downside of the market. It only involves a series of green candles, then a candlestick with a, a small body in between followed by red candlesticks. This only signifies that market makers have induced funds that are, that are increasing the demand of the court pair of the court currents within that pair. Shooting star. This looks like a hammer, but now in an inverted style. It also signifies the, buy, the, the selling pressure within the market or the injection of funds within the market by market makers. If you see this after three swipes uh, to the high from the Asian range, it, all, it actually gives you an edge to take your trade in that direction. So basically all these candlesticks that we were talking about are the most important candlesticks pattern that you have to know to implement within the market maker cycle. Taking trades out of um, the market context will not yield any results. So basically trading these candlestick patterns randomly will not yield you results. So they must be in the rightful market maker context for them to work perfectly. They should be on the second leg of W or M or on the ID50, which is the intraday 50 bounds on the EMA 50. So if you cannot understand this concept, refer to the videos on the cards or in the description below so that you can understand what the market maker context that we are talking about is. So in conclusion, follow your plan without deviation or hesitation to act. Forex is not for the weak-hearted, it's not for the faint-hearted, it's for those who can calm their thoughts after losses, who can compose themselves even after the trades goes against them. On that note, thank you for watching, like and subscribe and check out our free Signals Telegram channel, this is the link.